So I'm very much involved with preventative medicine. I look at designing microchips that can help not necessarily cure patients, but early detect certain diseases that if we know about them early enough, we can prevent them from happening. So I set up a business called DNA Nudge to try and demystify the process of trying to reduce type 2 diabetes, particularly within this obese population. And the way we're doing it, we're actually using DNA. So effectively, you know, there are particular markers in your genome that give you various propensities to things like type 2 diabetes, obesity. What we do, we say, okay, if you've got the predisposition or risk for type 2 diabetes, then and if you went to a clinician or a dietitian, they would say to you, be careful of saturated fat, be careful of sugar. What we have done is we've got this cloud and in the cloud, we've got every single product within the supermarkets within the UK. And then we relate the macronutrients that are in those products to those various markers or genes. So we know if you've got a particular pattern, what macronutrients are good or bad for you. And as a result of that, we condense it down to an actionable result. So effectively you can then shop and it will give you either a green, which is good for your DNA, or a red, which is bad for your DNA. And over time, just making these small changes between less sugary products or products that have less saturated fat, over time you could be saving kilograms of sugar from your bloodstream without even realizing it. Technologies can simplify that decision-making where mindless, unhealthy eating becomes mindless, healthy eating and glucose levels go down and you become healthy and start leaving those pre-diabetic levels.